So still on the topic of director navigation, setting up of a vertical navigation waypoint that uh, will allow us uh, to be notified uh, for a descent. Um, again, for the direct to button, uh, we can uh, set the vertical navigation up to any, any altitude we choose, essentially, um, uh, that makes sense uh, for us to descend towards and, uh, and an offset, like four, in this case, four miles prior to the, to the airport. Uh, once we have set that up, um, we can now also uh, we, we we see the uh, the top of descent waypoint here, uh, and it's 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 drawn onto the um, onto the fl flight path now uh, on our track. Uh, we can now change some of the information, and and most notably, uh, we're going to want to uh, get into the VNAV profile and uh, change the flight path angle, have a different angle. Maybe instead of 500 foot per minute, we want to have a different descent rate. Uh, and as, as we do that, uh, as we change that, the foot per minute uh, here uh, changes. So, so it's either going to be a more shallow descent or a steeper descent uh, than uh, moving, uh, essentially moving the um, actual uh, waypoint as well, the des descent waypoint uh, that we have set. So uh, depending on, on, on how shallow we want to make that, uh, the waypoint keeps moving. Uh, if I make it a really shallow descent, the waypoint keeps moving towards my present position and gives me, in this case, only a 400 foot per minute or, or, or a lesser descent, at, let's say in this case 1.8 degree uh, flight path angle.